everybody, it is me, Margaret. I wanted to come on and say hey, cause things have been kinda nuts with the move. But this is the second pod, it is empty! And I just realized, I hope I'm on the right channel again. I didn't check. So let me know which channel I'm on. Oh dear, did I get it started on the wrong channel? Anyway, I'm gonna just go. <laughs> because I think I'm on the right channel, All right, whatever. Okay, so we got the second pod in today. Today's been crazy. I'm gonna sit. I'm gonna try to sit. No, I'm not gonna sit, it's dirty. Okay, so we got the second pot in. It came in yesterday, and then the today, hey, we had um, the movers come to unload it. We had 80 T people come, and the AC guys had to come back. Hey, hey, everybody. So I'm gonna do another walkthrough. I, I'm doing this just one to check in with you guys because. I feel like I'm not getting to talk to you and I'm not getting to do the kind of videos I normally do but this way I feel like I can still like touch base with everybody and get in your business um, or whatever anyway thanks <laughs> thanks Jan um, so I just want to show you the progress and just kind of walk you through what's been going on and just say hey hey Gina yeah and I, this, hey Joni how's it going I was telling Randy like I need grown-up people interaction oh you saw, oh yeah i was on brian g's <laughs> he's great he's great yeah um oh thanks debbie yeah those are those ones these are the ones i just got yeah um hello hello okay so let's go in so the adt people came today and i got cameras it got fancy i got the fancy doorbell here let's go okay here we go uh oh i'm covering the camera with my finger like that i'm touching you with my finger Boop. Okay, so there we go. We've got, look, I got the fancy doorbell, right? Oh my gosh, it's so hot. I'm staying inside. Look, my phone is telling me there's motion at your front door. Yes, it's me. Hello. Hey, Debbie, can you, this, this fella needs to like go to timeout or something. Okay, so this is where, where we're at now. We've got more stuff. There's the elliptical. We're still missing some stuff. This is going to be Randy's office. There's Mimi. Hey, Mimi. What you doing? Nothing. That's what. Okay, y'all. Oh, my gosh. Just look. So now we've got more boxes. I've been unpacking boxes and putting furniture together. Look. Pancake! Get down! Psst, psst, psst. Anyway. Okay. <laughs> Let's do that again. So, yeah. I, I unloaded everything as much as I could. Which may or may not have been a good idea. Because... Because the dishwasher's broken. <laughs> um, so now, and I have to wait now. I got a hold of them seven days before they bring a new one. So that'll be fun. I'm going to have to wash all this stuff by hand, I guess. I know when we packed it, it was clean. But for, for me, like, I just can't take something out of a cardboard box and, like, eat off of it. So I'm going to have to wash all this stuff. Anyway. Anyway, so now it's a giant mess. Look. Ah, here she is, messy kitchen. Don't you love the messy kitchen? It'll make you feel better if your house is a mess. Mine is messier. <laughs> and so this is already like three boxes of things that we're gonna downsize. A <laughs> giant mess, yeah. But look at all, look at all of what I unpacked today. So this is what all I unpacked today. Ooh, yeah. And then in the garage, I'll show you. Wait, I think I just locked it. I can show you the stuff I unpacked yesterday. Where's the light? Look, ooh, ah. And then because we need more stuff, right? Hang on, let me flip that around. Because we like decided we didn't have enough stuff, our neighbors were moving out. <laughs> so, and they were getting rid of stuff and we're like, hey, I like to dumpster dive. So we went and got into their trash and we got some stuff from their trash. <laughs> But, look, okay, I got this. This was in their trash, right? It's perfectly good, it just needs to be wiped down. This bike was in the trash. It was put out for the big heavy trash. This bike was in their big heavy trash. And then this, and then also that. So we got all of that. We got all of that from our neighbor's trash pile this morning. Oops. Um, so yeah, we got more stuff now. <laughs> okay, hang on. Let me turn it around. I know, right? That's what I was telling the boys. Like, Randy's like, well, we don't really need new bikes or anything. I'm like, um, it's in the trash. 
even if they don't need a new bike, go get that bike. They could sell it and get like five or 10, even if they get five bucks, that's five bucks sitting on the curb, right? Okay, whatever. <laughs> okay, here we go. All right, back inside. So now, last time, time we talked, I think we were sleeping in here. Hey, Pris. Oh, look, there's a solo cup. But we've been putting the kitties in here now for when the, when the guys are moving. What about a kid who has no bike? That's right. Uh, that's the deck. It's, yeah, that's our tree, hall tree. Hall tree. So now we were sleeping out here. Look, I put, what is going on with you cats today? Lukey, get down. Oh my gosh. I put the table together. Ooh, ah. <laughs> and then, now we were, we were sleeping out. Look at this, isn't this just a giant mess? I hope it makes you feel better, guys. More mess. Okay, yes. <laughs> No, 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 don't say sorry. This is just life right now. Okay, let's go up and, and see. <laughs> if nothing else, maybe it'll make everybody, look, the stairs are clean. Look how clean these stairs are. Oh, maybe I'll just stay here in the peaceful stairs <laughs> with no mess. All right, here we go. Ready for it? Deep breaths, here we go. All right, more stuff I unpacked. Now, now, <laughs> this is, <sighs> deep breaths again, right? I don't know, I don't even know what to say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, I think, I think we're gonna have to get rid of more stuff. Are you gonna, <laughs> let me lean against the wall. Oh yeah, yeah, I will, I will, Dana. <laughs> um, yeah, okay, so let me just turn it. I was trying to collect my thoughts. So this is our homeschool, like, tower. And that's going to end up going against this wall. So I'm going to have to take those big shelves off the wall. But then, these are two recliners. I know. And I don't know if where we're going to put them. That's my chair that I would sit in for my videos. But I don't know where I'm going to put that either. So, here's one boy room sort of getting there maybe look he spent the day taping christmas lights to his dresser isn't that fun <laughs> and then here's the other one ready you ready Creak. Reek, 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 reek. <laughs> that's the bed that's why we're sleeping downstairs why is the light on and then my workroom work oh yes recliners in the reading nook and then here's this so this is all workroom stuff, like reseller stuff and homeschool stuff. Hi, you guys are following me. Okay, that works. So yeah, sorry if my hand is a bit unsteady. Okay, then let me, the bedroom's getting there. Let me go show you the bedroom. Oh wait, I forgot to turn the light out. Ooh, I know, right? Oh. Yeah, the AC guy's gonna have to come back again, but that's okay. Okay, here we go. See, look, it's getting there. Now we have a bed, sort of. More boxes. And yeah, so it's, yeah, it's getting there. More boxes. So yeah, my mirror will go up above there. Yeah, I know, so there we go. How do we have so much stuff, you guys? <laughs> How is there so much stuff in this house? So we have one more pod coming. I don't know how that's going to go. We'll see. Um, but I think in the other pod, it's like garage stuff. Oh, thank you. <laughs> yes, thumbs up. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, so we in the other pod, we've got garage stuff. So I think maybe it won't be so bad. Because we have a riding lawnmower, because we had a much bigger yard at our last, at the other house. And so, we're not going to need a riding lawnmower here, because it'll look ridiculous. It'll be like three zooms across the yard and we're done. Zoop, zoop, zoop. I know, right, Diane? <laughs> um, same thing with the backyard. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, so, yeah. 
So how are you guys doing? <laughs> I think we're gonna go to the pool tonight. The neighborhood has a few pools in it. And so I think we're gonna take the kids to one of the pools tonight and um, just kind of get away from it all. But I really, I wanted to, look at these two, hang on. I wanted to come say hey. Yeah, I'm here now. Look who we've got. There's Leia and Pancake. Pancake. Okay, anyway. Yeah, we are, um, it is hot, right? It's, it's, we've had a lot of, um, sorry. We're just going to say hey to Pancake real fast. Hey, Pancake. Pancake. You are just really watching Leia right now. Okay. Um, I'm just, I'm like, what are they doing? I don't know. What is she doing? She's usually the top. Like when she gets on the kitty tower, I bet she's trying to get rid of him. She's trying to like push him off. <laughs> I could teach the voice to drive with that. What, Leia, are you trying to get Pancake off of there? Are you gonna start pushing him off? I don't know. She, she is usually the top of the cat tower. So she may be trying to intimidate him and get him to get off of there. Um, <laughs> she will lay there. Ah. I'm trying to get good light, but it's just not going to work. How, how about this? I'm going to... Oh, that's not working. Come on, Pop Socket. Do your thing. What are, we, what, what are you good for, Pop Sockets? Not to stand. Here we go. Okay. Okay. How about that? There. Now can we see? I'm really close to the camera. Hang on. This is really weird feeling, being so close. Up close and personal. Okay. I'm talking to grown-ups. I'm so excited. Um, I forgot what I was saying, though. She is, she's totally, she's totally the, the king, queen of the castle. Um, I don't know what else to say. I'm just happy to be talking to you guys, honestly. I went to the grocery store yesterday by myself and it was just amazing. I posted something about it, I think on Instagram, like I am at the grocery store all alone. Um, so that was good, yeah. It's, it's this summer has been really tough. Anyway. Anyway, um, I'm looking forward to getting my workroom set back up and everything so I can get things rolling for that. Did I get your email? I'll have to check, Connie. Um, it's been kind of crazy. It's been really, really crazy. So I'll check my email and see. Texas Gal Treasures one, right? If you sent it there. I'll look. I'll go look. Um, I don't know what else to say. I'm just gonna be honest. I just wanted to come hang out. We got another kitty coming. The only one we're not seeing now is Luke. We saw him on the table though. Hey, Mimi, where are you going? And she's disappearing into the darkness. No, there she comes, okay. Um, we, what else, what else? I'm gonna go out garage selling tomorrow if for no other reason just to be uh, out by myself. So I'm gonna go out and I'm, I'm gonna try to look for ones that say, estate sale and jewelry because I've been having really good luck with estate sale jewelry stuff. I hear you. What are you doing? Um, thank you. Yeah, they're so sweet. I've got four cats, so they, they take up. <laughs> yeah, Mikey calls her a little black storm cloud. He's like, I see a little black storm cloud. Um, oh no, Connie. Okay, I'll, I'll do that. So yeah, when I go check, because the last few estate sales I've gone to, I've gotten amazing jewelry for like, like these ones were 50 cents, you know, like really, really cheap stuff that, I guess they're ones that weren't run by companies or something, so I've, I've done really well. Not that I need more stuff, but if I hadn't gone out, I wouldn't have gotten these, you know, if you didn't see, these ones ended up being 18 karat gold, and the mark, which I didn't know what it was because it looked like just a weird design, and I shared it, and someone said that it was 18 in <clears throat> Arabic, I think. So then I looked it up, and sure enough, um, it was. And somebody else said, oh, when I was in Iran or something, this is really, you know, style maybe you would see more Middle Eastern. So I was like, ooh. So, yeah, 15, I mean, 50 cents was totally worth me going out. Yeah, yeah, right? Um, okay, and then a, another pin that I ended up getting from, I can't remember, it was from the last haul. I don't think it was from this one. It was the one for, that I just did. Um, a little pin that was like a pearl on this like leaf and stem. 
I ended up looking at it closer, <clears throat> pardon me, <clears throat> sorry, and it ended up being marked 14K, and I shared it in the jewelry group and was saying, I can't figure out what the maker's mark is on it, but it, it's a 14K one, and it was in a baggie with like three other things for 50 cents, so there's stuff out there. So maybe it won't be such a big deal that there's not as many jewelry jars for me to find because I'm finding some really good scores. And I'm noticing in Austin, I'm finding way more cool vintage stuff, which is going to make it hard because I want to buy it and I don't, I don't think I need it. I don't think I need it in the house. So anyway, um, let me know. I don't know. I just, just say, Hey, uh, yeah. And they're inside Francis. The, that's another positive because it's so hot that most of the time the estate sales are inside. So I don't have to be out in this crazy, whatever, 104 degrees it was today. Yeah. So it's, oh, it's been really good. Um, another thing, this is, this is an interesting point for my kids, especially because we're, we're by a golf course, there's a guy in the neighborhood who buys golf balls. And apparently, I see after this, I've seen them on eBay as well. But um, the kids have been collecting golf balls that they find like in the yard, or in, as we take walks, like in in the, in the street, or in other people's yards as we're walking around. Like their front yards will be a golf ball sitting there. Um, so we so far they've just been hoarding them. But I've got I'm gonna get them a bucket to start putting them in so that they can make some money collecting golf balls. <laughs> right every little every little which way that they can make some money that'd be good anyway okay I am gonna go I guess I'm gonna make some dinner if you yeah <laughs> yeah for a kid it's like a buck you know some of them are like a buck per ball that's pretty good money um if you didn't see this if you eat ham I posted this I think I posted on Texas gal treasures too on my Facebook page um, I went to Honey Bake Ham. This is a deal for a, a, a frugal deal thing. thing. The, if you can go to Honey Bake Ham store, they sell their ham bones there. And usually it's not just the bone. It's got a ton of meat left on it. Um, and they have their ham bones. Buy one, get one free right now. So I got four ham bones for $28. And they were like six or seven pound ham bones each so and today tonight like I put you know I had put one in the fridge so tonight I cut all the meat off of it and then I'm gonna make beans with the, the bone and there's still a bunch of meat on it so but I filled up two big you know bowl things bowl things like storage bowls full of ham and then the, I'll have the bone the ham bone for the for the beans so if you're into that kind of thing frugal stuff um, you know Go check out your, yeah, you can make soup. My kids love pinto beans. That's like our, you know, it's like comfort food. A big old thing of pinto beans with a ham bone in it with some cornbread and get some relish. And it's really good. So, yeah, green pea soup. I don't know if my kids would eat that. I guess I should try. Now I got four ham bones. I guess I could try it. Yeah, get some cornbread. Mmm. So, it's pretty good. Pretty good stuff. Um, so, and my, and my dad was tell is the one that told me about this and he told me, don't tell everybody cause then they're going to go buy all the ham bones and I won't be able to get any. There's enough ham bones <laughs> out there. I think he was joking, but, um, he said my sister uses the Instapot and, and usually like when we make the, the beans, it takes all day. And he said he, she made it there with the Instapot and it was ready in like four hours. And he said they left it for the rest of the day. Good dog just went by. Um, and it tasted like it had been like really cooking for like two days. It was like really intense flavor. So I just unpacked my Instapot. I still haven't played with it. I got it for Christmas. <laughs> Don't tell my mom. Yeah, I use a slow, usually use a slow cooker, but I keep hearing amazing things about Instapot. So my mom got me one for Christmas. And I just, because we were all enough people, we just never got to play with it. So I'm going to use it this weekend. Yeah. Oh, it's a golf course. Okay. Um, pinto beans, fried potatoes, corn. Oh yeah. Sliced tomatoes. That sounds so good, Barbara. Yeah. Am I, am I, and during the summertime, it wasn't a meal. It, like, especially with my grandmother and my dad, it's in the summertime. It's not a meal unless you got a sliced tomato on the table. Get some salt on that. Yeah. 
I'm really excited. Yeah, everybody's hungry now. <laughs> we just had ham. We just had straight cold ham. And I'll probably give the kids some salad or something like that. Or some fruit. I don't know. They just ate a lot of ham. So, okay. Um, I'm going to go. I'm going to. Yeah, I really want to get back on schedule with some more reseller related videos. If you've got questions or if you've got stuff you want to know more about that I can help with, leave me a comment for sure because I could definitely use direction right now. Um, and if you're just interested in like, just come and chat while well, I'm, I'm, that's what I'm doing right now. And I'm going to keep doing that and just keep you guys up to date with what's going on. And if you did, if you noticed, I showed, um, we decided to go ahead and let the get guys, I tried to decide again to let the boys be on the channel. I, it's happened once before and then I freak out. Normally it's when I watch like the news or something late at night and then, or I read the news on the internet and then I get scared because of creeps out in the world. And so it freaks me out. And so I go and take all the videos and pictures down of my kids. So, once again, Randy and the kids have said, um, okay, it's okay, Mom, you, we can be on there. Because I'm like the buffer. It's not like somebody's like commenting to my kids and they're not, they're just reading it without me being there, you know. They don't have instant access to any of it. Anyway, so we did a munch pack and um, we have our homeschool honey channel which we we've, we've put two videos up on they're from Easter but they're still fun so I'm trying to get the videos we did from before put up over there on homeschool honey so go over there and show some love and um and I'll be back soon what's tomorrow Saturday maybe I'll have a haul tomorrow would that be fun um okay go over there and hit the thumbs up and I will talk to you guys soon. Thanks for coming to hang out with me, everybody. Oh my gosh, grown-ups. Yay, group hug. Group hug. Okay, yay. Okay, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye, everybody. <laughs>